What does it mean when someone says we have a STEAM problem? So I really love this question. Um, the origin for me is really the idea of STEM, and that's science, technology, engineering, and math. That has been evolved to the concept of STEAM, which is science, technology, engineering, art, and math. It's pretty much the same thing except for you're including arts, because a lot of times the arts are excluded and, and we don't really feel that that is a true discipline when it comes to education or it is considered uh, extracurricular activity like gym, like other things, um, uh, even like computer, like uh, computer literacy courses are considered vocation and not primary, uh, uh, not a part of the, the primary, uh, I guess, uh, coursework. So for me, uh, when people say that, they're, they're looking uh, traditionally, in the U.S. we've created this uh, idea of, you know, STEM. And, and what we do is we have a lot of STEM programs. And the government is subsidizing a lot of activity to encourage kids to enter STEM careers. And now it's being extended to STEAM careers. And it's great because we recognize the fact that we aren't competing at the global scale where if you look at a lot of the kids that are coming out of college, coming out of high school, and you will look at their counterparts throughout the world, we are way behind. And I feel that we're not doing that because we, we want to be better than everyone. I think we're doing that because we want to remain competitive and be able to work in this global marketplace. And that's the reason why we're doing it. <laughs> but people have different thought processes and ideas on that but for me you know I like that the fact I like that my government now is saying hey you know we really need to solve this problem so for me um, I am an engineer I was uh, trained as a computer scientist which is a we call them programmers web developers software engineers uh, based off of your experience the medium you work in that's really most people that take like computer science track will fall in. Some people also are uh, considered developers or engineers if they have like an info information systems uh, degree as well. And I know when I was uh, younger, uh, I think it was a lot more inter interest in like uh, STEAM, you know, careers. And it, it could just be I was totally biased because I was in a I was in like a STEAM career and or like I should say field of study and everybody else I knew but I don't really feel that that's necessarily the same with the generation of today but with this problem that we're having uh, we have to figure out creative ways of addressing the fact that we don't have a lot of uh, kids going into science technology engineering arts and math and we need to figure out a way to increase that and really, we, we want to be able to remain uh, relevant in the world, on the world stage. And that's really what it's about. So, that's what it means when people say we have a STEAM problem. I'm probably going to do some more talks about what are some specific things you can do to help. Or, if you're a parent and you don't really have a, a science, math, or engineering background, how can you get your kid involved or how can you encourage them? I'll do some more, but... Uh, if you have any questions or any other topics you want me to talk about, just let me know. Thanks. Bye.